Morning guys, we're on Tuesday the 16th and it is still January. So, not one for having breakfast every single day, but sometimes, you know, you just feel really hungry and I am quite hungry. So, I have made some toast i've put some honey and banana on top i haven't used any butter or anything that's the bread i used and then i've used the spreadable the set honey rather than the runny stuff and then just sliced a banana up so i'll stick a breakdown on screen that is what i'm having for my breakfast i was going to go to the charity shop with my mother but she did make a good point. We're literally passing the door where it is on Friday. So we're going to wait till Friday to nip in there. And I'm going to take her to lunch for, um, to Tesco. Very exciting. But she said there's a couple of bits she wants in Tesco. So I'm going to take her there. And then I've decided to make tuna pasta bake for tea. And I'm going to make garlic bread with some baguettes and garlic gold. I picked up the tuna pasta bake sauce yesterday and I'm putting it in a cupboard yet and it was looking at me this morning when I was in the kitchen so I thought yep I'll make you. I've got tuna in the cupboard so yeah that is a breakfast and I will catch up with you probably when I'm with my mother. So I'll see you then. Got my mother now. It was a bit later than I thought because I felt awful. We nearly didn't come. What time is it? About quarter past one. I haven't got a clue. Oh, oh, I've turned the car off now. It's about quarter past one. So we're going to go into Tesco and get some lunch. I'm going to get some pick a pick a lily I got to get. Have you got a list? Um, I said I need pick a lily. Have you got a list? Yeah. What, a mile long or? No, it's in the front of my bag. Little bag. Right, let's go and get some grub then. Right, we're in the cafe and they've revamped all their menu. Well, I'll say revamped, they've taken away all the Christmas ones. So, I've ordered myself and my mother cheese and spring onion toasties, 575 calories. So, that's what we're having. I've got no cake or nothing. My mother's got a biscuit, but show you when it comes. Oh, we're back in the car and I feel like the walking dead. Oh, I feel terrible. Don't know what's come over me, man. But I don't feel well. Get across in now. We're looking for your key. Mm. Oh God, I feel like um, I feel like I've died, but I've still got a heartbeat. <laughs> oh. oh, dear me! What are you gonna do for your tea then? Do you want the pasta bake I'm making? She didn't pick up a pork pie. Or well, you can have that roll I made you. It's ham and cheese. No, don't. Or I can make you beans on toast. Don't worry about it. Oh, who cares about me? I can do beans on toast. I got 125 no, I eggs. I got a million eggs. Do you want scrambled egg on toast? I've got nice bread there. I can do scrambled egg on toast if you like. Alright, thank you. What I'll do is I'll time it so that I do it. I'll either do it and drop it off on my way out or I'll um, get the kids to run down with it. Okay? Got one or two toast. Oh, one's enough. One's enough. 
one slice of toast and how many eggs do you want? Two? <clears throat> oh my god, see that then? Little Fiat 500. Um, I think it might be electric. It's one of the fancy sporty ones. £399 a month. It's a lot. For what? A little Fiat 500. Fancy one of them, but you know, I'm far too big for one of them. Like trying to squeeze me into a friggin' like, trying to put a square peg in a round hole, wouldn't fit. Do you remember when you had that Kia Picanto and you told me to drive it and I couldn't fit in it? Remember, and then I couldn't fit in your car. What? You insured me on your Kia Picanto and we went to go out one day and you said, oh, you can drive and I went to get in and I couldn't get in. Oh. That was too big. And then when I lost that weight then, I actually went and bought one. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. Your um, Gets that you had was a good car and then they stopped making them. Remember that one? You had a black gets I remember that one Jill it was good it was nice and roomy oh god I need to go back to the doctors and get your owing tablets but there's no rush because you're all right for that one one of your um Joxins. Jackson will be home from school. <clears throat> Dexter said, will you pick me up? And I said, no, I don't think I'll be back in time. He'll be finished any minute, but if I go up to the car park, he um, probably miss me unless I ring the school quickly and tell him to tell him. How does it, well, how does he know if you are, if you, if you turn up? He doesn't. Just luck if you see him. No, I'll tell him if I'm picking him up. I used, I used to always pick him up, but as he's got older, he's like, oh, I'll walk. I'll ask him if he wants to do boxing tomorrow because I can do a Wednesday. It's an hour and a half. I'll ask Jackson if he wants to do it. Right, let's drop you home and then I'll see if I can find Dexter. I found him found my little dex but he's not happy with me. I think that's an understatement. That's an understatement. He's not happy with me. He wanted to go to a club after school and uh, he asked me last night and I was busy and I said yeah 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 I'll sort it out and I didn't and because I haven't signed for the night I'll go. He's going next week. I just spoke to the school. And He's going to be starting boxing tomorrow, aren't you, yeah. Dexter? Yeah. Well, he will be if he perks up and doesn't act like he's acting now. Because the man in Tesco, I call him the trolley man, he does more than just the trolleys. Um, but he runs a boxing club up the road from us in the community centre. Centre. He does it on a Wednesday and a Friday. And I did take Dexter when he was um, about five. And he played up like a right div. 
so I didn't take him again. He wasn't interested in boxing, he was more interested in pissing around. But now he's 11, um, he can go. It's an hour and a half for me. I said to the guy, just stay and wait with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, I'm going. I honestly don't want me to get involved. I'm not flexible enough to be a boxer. I'm a fighter, not a boxer. All right, misery pants. No. Why? Why? Because I forgot to do something. <laughs> That's the tantrum, tantrum pants side of Dexter you don't see. I'll be boxing him now and He's <laughs> looking in the mirror. What's the matter, love? Huh? Can you get the shopping out the back? I'll catch up with you in a bit, guys. You are? I couldn't be bothered to answer my phone. Actually, I had my phone on silent, so it didn't ping when I was recording. And that's why I didn't hear the phone. My bad. He'll get over it. He'll get over it. Right, I'm back in. Oh, God. I don't know what's up with me today, but I don't feel all right. Tesco's. Did I get Just Pick a Lily? No, I didn't. Toilet roll. When I got in as well, my... Uh, my stuff was... Let's have a look at this, actually. My stuff from the catalogue I ordered. I ordered these in a 20, 28, 30, 28 to 30. Ooh, they feel thick. The light's just gone off. That's just about right, isn't it? Sulking Dexter, my lights just need to charge in. Let's put the old lights on. Right, that'll do for now. Well, they look quite big. <laughs> well, they are quite big. Oh, uh, guinea pigs are off on one. What? The light's fused. No, it hasn't. you just got to use... No, use the other one. You've got to get it fixed. Use the other... Get your light. Turn it over. Yeah, no. Depends which day it is, what switch works. Nevada. Yeah, it's quite big. You tell. Yeah, Nirvana with that on it. Do that, do me hair, bit of makeup. I might not look 50. I'm not looking 28. Why do you want that? Mm -hmm. Use the one that's not in the packet though, there's a loose one in there. Cooking himself pizza. I got this one. Mom, there is no one in the loose packet. There is, it's on the shelf. Well, Mackenzie's had that while we've been out. Well, well, I've been out then. Yes. Just that one with Nirvana on. <clears throat> And then, got another one. Guess what that's got on it? Nirvana. Well, I was like, oh, I love Nirvana t-shirts. Well, they fit me. And I'm like, well, they're a bit girly. Although that one, with the face on, you could probably get away wearing that. Around, he'd only wear it around the house though, because it'd be a bit big on him. And it's a ladies, but you know, who knows, who cares? Who cares? Anyway, they're my three new tops, which I'm keeping. They were on offer, so I bought them while they were on offer. Right, what did I get? I didn't get a lot. Oh, I got this. This was, it's not for you, guinea pigs. I'm doing the old squeeze.
week in. Um, this was up the aisle, the, I call the foreign aisle, where they got like the Polish stuff and Indian stuff. And it's a cornflake mix. And if you look, it's got like cornflakes, it's got little nuts in, it's got like long bits that you get in Bombay mix. It's a savoury Indian snack. 100 grams is 143 calories. No, it's not. I, I totally lied then. For 100 grams, it's 509 calories. For a 28 gram portion, it's 143 calories. But the reason I bought that, I thought I would coat some chicken breasts in that. And it'd be a nice, crispy, tasty chicken. I'll make little nuggets. That's why I bought that. Although I might have a little bit in a bowl at night time as a snack. Semi-skim milk, four to six calories for 100 ml. I'm a bit blind. Do me a favour. Do me a favour, Dex. Can you get my glasses, please? I've left them in the downstairs um, toilet. Right. If you're not, if you've got over yourself now. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. That's good. A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Strawberries. I do have some strawberries in the fridge, but I like the look of them. They look nice and fresh. I've got those. I picked up two of these, their own brand applesauce. It says new on there. Um, can you also sign um, up for rugby? Hang on. Give me them back. Can you also sign me up for rugby? Thanks. Can I sign you up for rugby? Yeah. You're doing a lot, do you? Boxing, rugby, sewing. Going to sewing class. You can take out my trousers then if you can sew. Um, hundred and four per hundred grams. So I got two of them because I saw a cake where you use ap apple sauce. So I thought mm, I'll get two of them. I purchased this. Was a bit random. I purchased this one single microfiber cloth. They had a box full of microfiber cloths. They've got no ticket on them. The woman just scanned the, the sponge tech label. I think it was 75p for one cloth. For one cloth. Their yogurts were on offer. You can need my specs for this. They're Lindahl's Blueberry Muffin. That one is 92 calories per portion. No grams in there. Oh yeah, per pot. So 92 calories per pot. I got two lemon cheesecake, 92 calories. Lemon cheesecake. And I also got a banoffee pie, which is 90 calories. So I got them, they were on offer. I purchased some multi-surface wipes, some Reese's um, peanut butter eggs, they're for me. They're flat, they like half an egg, mini ones, but they're not round. And they are 559 calories for 100 grams with the 70 grams in there. That's all that's in the bag apart from the said Piccalilli. I just got in Tesco zone because it was a lot cheaper than Branston's. 10 calories, a tablespoon. So I've got that. And then I've got a couple of things in this bag, not much. Jackson, my um, middle child. Addicted to Weetabix. <coughs> he is addicted to Weetabix, yeah. That's a good thing to be addicted to. But he um, he's very snob, snobberized. He's very snobby and will only eat the proper genuine Weetabix. He won't have Tesco's own or that. He says they're not the same. So I bought these, £4.50, it's a lot of money in it for a box of cereal. But it is a family pack and there's lots of 
There's 48 in there, so it should last a while. And they are 136 for two biscuits. And as you know, if you're a slimming welder, you can do wonders with Weetabix. Um, I bought these because they were on offer. I do have a lot of porridge in, but Dex is always eating porridge. Not always. Um, you are always eating the porridge. Oh, well, I got you that one. Do you like that? Don't. Strawberry, raspberry and cranberry. <laughs> yeah. Give it a go, will you? That was on offer for £2 instead of 3 50 I think, so I picked them up. 209 calories a sachet. Is that made up with milk? Yeah, with 180 ml of semi skim milk. So I got that. A bag of pasta, 300 calories for 170 grams cooked. I've got two packets of these. They are 380 calories for 100 grams. I did buy them, you know, because I thought they'd take quite a long time to eat because they're like them kiddies necklaces, but obviously the kids don't have them. And then I got two rices because they were on offer. I got golden vegetable. That one is 166 for half the pouch. And I got savoury chicken. And that one is 168 for half the pouch. That's everything I bought. I didn't get a lot. Because I've only just been shopping. And Warren will come in and be like, oh, you've been shopping again. You know. Who goes into Tesco for one thing and comes out with one thing? Not me. Right, I've got stuff to do tonight. It's four o'clock. I've got to make grandma. Grandma's having scrambled egg on toast. You take it down for me in a bit. Yeah? Shut up. Um, yeah. It's after one of these years. Right, you're going to take grandma's scrambled egg down? Yes. Well, I made it yet. Okay. And then we're going to nip to Talbot Green. Half past six, and then Daddy will probably go to bed, and then I'll make dinner when we come back. It won't take long. Tuna pasta bake. Fancy that? And homemade garlic bread. <sighs> right, I'm going before I collapse. Go make me. Go make your mother a drink, babe. Sure. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I'll catch you in the next clip, guys. I'm going to bed. It's half past nine. Got my Nirvana t shirts there. Um, I feel absolutely dreadful. I have got 995 calories left because I haven't had any tea. I've literally had my toast and banana and honey, that um, toasty that I had in Tesco. I don't even feel hungry. I don't know what's the matter with me. I don't know if I'm coming down with a lurgy. My cheeks have gone a bit red. Um, I just feel awful, so I'm going to drag myself to bed, get in my nightie, in my pyjamas, and lie on the bed. And hopefully in the morning I'll feel better. <sighs> I haven't got anything on tomorrow, which is, uh, which is good. I'll be pottering around here, straightening out the kids' disruption that they caused today. Stuff everywhere. But, uh, yeah, so I'll, uh... See you on the next one, hopefully a bit more chirpier.